Uh, kia ora no. Um, te kohanai, we are practicing uh, waiata that we will, you know, love to be able to share and all that when we are overseas with other people. <laughs> <laughs> See, when we're there, we're going to be working with little kids as well. So we don't want to just do adult kind of growing up songs. Yeah. And we also want to do ones that are useful maybe for teaching te reo. Because primarily we'll be teaching English, I suppose. But it's a great opportunity to teach some Māori while we're at it. And music is the best way, especially with kids. All right. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Ma is white. Fiddle is red, kakariki green. Pango is black, mango is two, a e i o u. Kofa yellow, karakaraka, kikorangi blue. Karakaraka is our orange, a e i o u. We're working on it. Yeah, we're working on it. Another one we want to do is uh, Rere Nga Wairua because, uh, well, because it's a cool song, maybe, mm. but also that will be overseas and we want to share something that's a bit more specific than just from New Zealand. Tahi Rua Turufa Rere Nga Wairua Tenda Whakarongo Mai Papakitu Ana Papakitu Ana Nga Tai O Te Tokero This new reo, and at the same time, we need to keep remembering our own reo. So, um, hard out, and then some of our own waiata. Yeah. yeah, it's exciting actually because we're preparing to go and share of ourselves with these songs and that. But mm. you know, of course, we're ready to absorb 
things from their culture, language, songs, and it's yeah, it's exciting. It's exciting to think because here in Aotearoa, we're always you know we're speaking English or we're speaking Maori, predominantly English. But um, when you throw a third one in the mix, it yeah, just you know it just like shakes it all up. It's hard. It's challenging. It's it's daunting. Yeah, absolutely. But it's all good. Joe, sure.